and welcome back to Baldur's Gate 3. I hope you don't mind if I just look around a little bit. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. You have nothing interesting. Do you know something about the book we have? Your terrible tidings have cost me everything! My grand design! Dash the ruins! This always happens to me! Ooh. Hey! Well, at least he wasn't hurt. still active if we told him that the alien is dead. I don't have so little help. Mother's milk, your visage speaks of ill tidings. Speak, ally mine. What troubles you? I wish I told you. A wizard called Larokan is looking for you. Is he indeed? Pray tell, what does he seek from Dame Aelin? Um... He put a bounty out for you, for your capture, and now there is a violent messenger looking for you. Let them come, and let them find me. Dame Aelin will strike down any who seek to bring her to harm's home. Yet, it is better to cut off the head of the snake, than to let its slithering snakeling swarm us unabated. This wizard, this wizard, must be held to account. I will wring his neck until he's dead. Hmm. I deceived him into thinking you're dead. <laughs> the weasel out weaseled. Well done, my friend. But Dame Aelin's deeds are great. Her presence, present. Sooner or later, he will discover that the daughter of Saluna lives. Let us travel to his chambers, his lair. We will see him undone, in the style of the dead, unburied Ketherick Thorn. I'm coming with you. I'd like to get a few licks in myself. My darling, we agreed you'd scout for the nearest Salunite Enclave this very night. Let us divide our efforts, all the sooner to be reunited. I won't let you go alone. Who knows what this wizard might have planned? Our closest ally will accompany me, won't you? It will be a swift and fruitful chore. Let her come, I need healing. I to this Leroican right away. Oh. I am as eager to meet him as he is to ensnare me. Can you heal me? Aelin left to face that wizard. Uh, Leroican, was it? Mm -hmm. Even after all she's been through, she thinks herself unstoppable, invincible. It all feels like recklessness to me. Well... She's reckless but powerful. He's probably already dead. I hope you're right. He sounds like a vile, vile man. I'd have liked to get a few licks in myself, honestly. I wanted to help her, but she said she fights better when she knows I'm safe. I understand, I suppose. I feel the same about her. Heal me. I'm going to help her. I'll rest a little easier if you do. Mm -hmm. You fought well against my father. Mm -hmm. I imagine a rat like Leroican will be nothing in comparison. Mm -hmm. I need healing. Oh. Yeah, it's healing. Oh, oh well. Nice, so after thinking it through, I wanna go with Carla and Shadowheart instead of Halston and Will because they have spells! Have we here? A magician in a tower, hiding away from the frightening world. What are you so scared of, Magus? 
Not the night song, surely. Why, she's nothing but a relic to be purchased and pursued. My God. The night song is a person. Uh, by my honor, it's you. My dear, I thought you were. You will address me with due deference. I am Dame Aelin. And you are a wealth without honor, without pride, with nothing but a tower full of trinkets. Oh, my apologies, Dame Aelin. I meant no disrespect. I asked our mutual friend here to make an introduction that I might get to meet the famed daughter of Saluna. Forgive me for that impudence. Perhaps our friend can bridge the gap and do what I believe they came here to do? I'm just here to watch. Do not play. Do not jest. We have come to square off against an enemy most loathsome. So speak, O oh loathsome one. Give me one good reason why I should not cave your head into your neck. <laughs> Dame Aelin, I have discovered a device that would allow your immortality to be shared. It would cause you no harm, no pain of any kind. You serve your mother, Saluna, I believe. She who has blessed our realm with so many gifts. Honor her by sharing yours. You dare to threaten me with the same magic that held me in torment for a hundred years! You do not seek to share my gifts. You seek to poach them. <laughs> I had hoped to appeal to your better nature. Perhaps I overestimated you. Hmm. No bother. I have an arsenal of implements capable of convincing you to see reason. Mm, you, know what? you know what? It's over. You can't overpower both of us. A pity you didn't prove a more reliable ally. I'm not your ally. Reap the rewards of my good favor. I don't care. I'd hoped you to keep an open mind. But it seems you're determined to make this as difficult as possible. Boy, at the ready. Once I've taken control of the Asima, she must go directly into the caging runes. No, Master Lerokan. I would never have assisted you if I knew you planned such horrors. You lied to get the Night Song here. Made us all believe she was nothing but a relic. I have seen what true leadership can accomplish, but never under your tutelage. Watch your tongue, you child. I could make it such that no wizard in the realm will touch you. If they're all like you, I think that sounds like an excellent bargain. <laughs> oh, face us, charlatan, we who detest you so. Fuck it. What? No, thank you. Um, Let's go. Be so kind. Uh, he's a wizard. He's a wizard. I have something for wizards. Break your target's gun. Silence him. Went. Hey. Okay. Uh, and you, dear, please heal. Sounds for one turn. Okay, you can go over there. Will that hit my allies? Not by enemies. Radiant. Got to press on. Could you move a little bit further? <laughs> Okay, never mind. Oh, right, uh, you need to keep concentration. Good job. 
What? Oh. Uh, okay. Silence is... Those arrows are useless. I mean, they are useful only when you are trying to... Okay, might as well just... Whew. Okay, can you get enough to hit him? Yep. Okay, be so kind and rage. Dude. Do you know who you are against? Oh, she's hurt badly. Please heal. <laughs> now what can be done? Oh. Are you nine meters? Kinda. Wait, what is that? Ah! Oh, that's so cute! Thank you, it still works. Roll on! Roll on! Good job, alien, good job. Can you help him? Hold on. Is she okay? She's almost dead. Um. Wait, can you shoot him? Disadvantage. Puff is interrupted. Um. Why or why do I never give you Mr. Step? Thank you. I actually am thankful that he hits me. Uh, and not someone else. Would it work? Do I need it? Direct phone companions with half their head themselves only by Alice they had longer. Ooh Roland He's still dead. Is he? Too heavy. I think he is still dead. Try again. 
he tried. That's why he's dead. Okay, don't risk it. Just shoot. Tactical. This is extremely risky. Need to learn the hard way. Okay. I won't... I mean, it won't work. Where's just simple attack? Oh, there it is. Okay, she is alive. How about Ro Rowan is dead. That divine intervention <laughs> wasn't really divine. Hit him. Ugh. Can you heal yourself? There it is. I know. I need you just to hold on a little bit longer. This one's dead. Um. Okay, can you go down here? A better position. If there was anything I could have done to help Roland, I would have. Still holding up <laughs> somehow. Um, Heading there. You can't strike. Oh, right. That makes sense. Um, Wait, not him, but him! He won't hit her back. <laughs> Okay, she can fly, so... Nice. I'm honestly amazed each time I see the spirit weapon hit something. Don't explode! Okay, thank you. Submission with profane gold. 
Let every wicked magus, every vile murtherer, each slaver and misery merchant see. Dame Aelin is watching. She is indomitable. And when her face lights the shadows of your wrongdoing, you are broken by its beauty. Do not get on her bad side. Oh. Well, um... The corpse regards you lifelessly. Most fortunate, Rowan. Few catch my interest, but your letters demonstrate potential. I am willing to give you a chance. However, a warning, you must be willing to do whatever is necessary. Power is not cheap, and I will not suffer weakness in my own student. That's why you suffered broken spine. regards you lifelessly how did you become the owner of this place <gasps> Ramesses, gone open for the taking <sighs> who is from as if <gasps> powerful mage How did you learn to imprison the night song? Ramesses notes. Balthazar's magic. Of course. Where do you store your valuables? Lower floor. Magic repository. Fault key. Any security measures I should be aware of in your repository? How do I avoid the traps? Where did Ramazif go? The corpse remains silent. It does not know. The spell's power wanes. You can ask no more questions. Do we have this spell magic? Hmm, something for our guys. And those things are for me. The firehead fool is dead. Yet as I stare upon his corpse, I feel... Sadness. Why? I know something of sadness, or at least the Bellas do. What does it feel like? A gripping in the chest. As though I'd lost someone. Something. Uh, uh, Paladin's fatigue, no doubt. You were excellent in battle. As is your way. And I am proud to fight at your side. I will catch my breath, then to camp I will bring my bones. Moon Maiden be with you. Mm-hmm. Let's see if there's anything here. Hmm. Ooh, Justy. What's in here? Mm. 
arrow for you, arrow for you, goldie for me. Let's get out of here. Hello. Let's have a look. Is there something in here? An arch for you. This why not? Seems simple enough. Okay, let's see. Ah, unfortunately, he did not tell me how to open it. Welcome back, dear patron. Remember that the great let yeah, yeah. your knowledge. Do I save? Okay, let's save. Don't touch me. Please open. Foot in a restricted area. A swift exit may be in order. Hmm. My humble apologies. I shall remove myself immediately. <laughs> Can I disable them as well? Pass, 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 pass without a trace. Where is it? I don't think that will keep me anything. The place you can see. Do you have this spell by any chance? This spell. No, evil and good. Oh, well, it's this spell magic or something like this. Darkness also would be useful. I mean, she has her own version. Are you ready? Reading this to the best. Wait, what? Branding Smite. With Radiant. Why? Do I don't understand something? Huh? Thirty percent. We can open it, but we cannot go inside. So you also should come in here. Um, maybe we have scroll of darkness or something like this. Blindness. Plutonian one. Huh. Maybe let's kill them. Okay, let's try that. Again. <sighs> Let's try convincing them. Uh, oh. It's me, your old friend Astarion. You wouldn't shut the door on a friend, would you? You've been 
granted free passage. Okay. What you do with that privilege is up to you. Thank you. You don't have permission to be here. You're about right. He's the one that, that's blinded. Wait. There's been an attack nearby. I have no idea what you're talking about. Your gentle spirit speaks for itself. You can't be the one responsible. Still alive. There's been an assault nearby. You might want to <sighs> presence here. Plus eleven. Are you sure someone was attacked? Perhaps they simply tripped. Do I have to persuade him? Talk your way out of this one. You've wandered into a forbidden area. You sense it might be. Hmm. Well, hello. Wait, give me a moment. He can. To a forbidden area. You sense it might be time to leave. I have no idea if that will work. Both. You've been granted free pass. Okay. It seems the rules have not changed in your absence. What the hell? Go for a good meal. Please go kill him. He's wandered into Never mind. Okay, um how would pass without a trace work? See so if I try to I guess you're on your own. There. Madam, it is no secret that yours is the finest collection of records within our fair city. This group brings you a query I believe only you can resolve. It has been a long held bit of law within my family that we are descendants of Larry Silverhand through my mother's line. Though no existing genealogy can confirm our claim, would you be so kind as to investigate the matter? It would mean a great deal to my grandmother, Haverfoss, who is probably at the minute. The uh, name, the family name is Gradle. Wait, what? Wait, what's that? Okay. Ah, okay. We don't need that. Mm -hmm. I don't like that he failed reception on really obviously <laughs> hidden door. Okay. Which one of you has high perception? Uh, plus three. Still breathing. Heh <laughs> heh. Plus five. So Yeah. Okay, never mind. Get inside. Maybe you will notice something. I hope. Uh huh. And the two of you. What the? Okay, allow me to save. Someone there? Hardly a challenge. Okay. 
Before her time as an exarch of temples and goddess of strategy, the Red Knight was a paladin most devout. She toured armies and world over as both student and teacher, and thus was she ever elevated by temples to her current status. These pages contain that of her which was left on the material plane after her ascension. Someone's a treasure trove of wicked spells. You have made hand, right? No. You do. Would you mind? Now go over there. And bring me the other one. Now go over here. Target is too far. Okay. In case something bad happens. This one already. Not this one, not this one we already had. <laughs> hmm. I have no idea how that worked, but it worked. There's another door here. It wasn't me. The game saved on its own. No entry to vaults. Trespassers will be disintegrated. Master Laroican. Hmm. Oh, and my hand is gone. Soldier. Ooh, speaking about this flower, I believe. Okay, and so before I get disintegrated, Dusty old wizards. <laughs> How tedious. This will be fun. I'm sure it will be fun. Yeah, especially if it's some of those traps. And I will disarm all of them, just in case. Those are closed, this one is open. Why? Traps. Foot, Place is trapped. Do I have any scroll? Hmm? Uh just want to ask you to put the night song. Last for about this time, divination spells be brought to the basement. He must focus without interruption. 
No. Hm. I mean, as long as they are on pen. Illusion. Wait. Light shows me where to... Ah, okay. Shows me transportation. Oh, no location transportation. What is it? It quick. Those two. Very well. Okay, let's try opening. Impossible lock picking. Okay. So again, silver hand. Abjuration. Abjuration Demon Oh, silver hand Evocation Foresight. Oh. <laughs> What's that? Oh, this one. Lower levels of system just now to find the dark hat codex. Silver hand. I'll try. I need to write it down. Clicked. Hey. Silver. Abjuration. Clicked. Pull the lever. Was the demon one? Demon, no. 
I'll be right back once I'm done with checking every possibility. Okay, so I found something. Under the witch. Ooh, I found a trap. Lot, lots of traps. Unlock hereby the path to the Elminster Vault. So now this is working. Oh! The Codex. You do fire limit with level spell, you burn yourself and gain additional bonus action. Yeah. The Necromancer Fae. There are secrets of life and death known only to the Red Wizards. Committing such secrets to parchment is a risk they are loath to take lest the unworthy gaze upon them. Who better than to guard their secrets than the spirits of the jealous dead themselves? To look upon the necromancer fae is to risk madness at the hands of its spirits, and the wise traveler who can thread the line between life and death will find knowledge witnessed by precious few mortals. The rest of the entry details the precautions and risk associated with reading the text, but lays out a clear path to unraveling the secrets contained in its, this tome. Well, Second room. Carses. Okay, I'll be right back and I try to unlock the other door. Okay, here's another one. Oops. A trap. Someone doesn't like visitors. Yeah, no wonder. The Carses. Unlock hereby the path to the Carses vault. And now I believe Wild should take us back all the way. Yep. Oh, I know I've been saving like crazy, but I think it's worth it. It's mine now. Really? It is a great paradox among our kind, who so value the art of learning that we believe ourselves ever tinier than the ones who came before. If envy is a disease of the artist, how hubris is that of the wizard? Though I fear my warning will fall on deaf ears. I will say it again, the closer wizard creeps to the domain of the divine, the closer oblivion creeps with him. I thought myself unequal to Mistra and devised a plan to make myself her equal. I would pluck one stand of weave and contain it within the an amulet I spent the better portion of my years devising. How regret instantly heaved itself upon my head. I was trapped within the amulet instantaneously and passed around from collector to curio hall for the better part of a millennium. Only now that I am freed, with barely the strength to hold my quill, can I leave this final warning as testimony. Hmm. A book on Netherese magic. Gale might like to know. Mm -hmm. Ooh, full breaker. More. Oh, that's something for you, I believe. What's the story? Isn't it? That's yours now. It's one hand weapon, but. You know. Okay, so now I believe we can go back. Let's save. I wanna open the book when we are in the camp. Hello, you 
set foot in a restricted area. My humble apologies. Exit maybe in order. I shall remove myself immediately. Come on, let's go. Hey, everyone. Okay. And if I remember correctly, there should be also a basement. I'm not dealing with that just yet. Okay, let's deal with that. Do you think that zombie looks fresh? Is fresh good? I never know with zombies. What? Oh, okay. Don't. Hmm. Don't mind me then. Ooh. <laughs> oh, hello, kitty. Where are you guys? Go talk to the cat. Hold, seeker. Have you come to swear yourself to Sharus by my paw? Who's Sharus? Mother of cats, feline of felicity, the only deity one should ever swear fealty to in these nine lives. Now, will you heed our mother's call and bolster her as she crushes the heathen absolute beneath her divine paw? Yes. Yes, yes. Together, we shall spread the word of the wonder in her every poor step. I will sing her name in the streets, and you will bring her prayers to those suffering two legs instead of four. Where is Horace? A civilization's downfall committed to parchment by the very hand that wrought its destruction the truth of the crown i hope all that stands between us and enlightenment is the turn of a page okay this isn't what i expected this is much more. The crown of Carsus. And this, this is no mere journal. It contains Carsus's original plans for the crown's construction. His designs for godhood. Design for self-destruction, more like then this crown kill Carsus? Not exactly. It was what he did with it that sealed his fate, and, for a time, that of magic itself. The crown was merely the means. The book states that the crown and netherstones were originally one construct, seemingly sundered at the moment of Carsus's downfall. If we can collect the crown setting and the three netherstones, and, with the correct invocation of certain spells and gestures detailed in these notes, I think... I could reforge it. We already know the crown's dangerous. Wouldn't that make things worse? Worse? It could be the best thing that ever happened to me. To us. Just think of it. The power of the gods in mortal hands at last. We'd be free of doctrine and dogma. Confined only by the limits of our imaginations. I promise you, the gods will never grant us such a blessing, no matter how much we worship and adore them. And you think Mr. will let you do this? I don't know. Ao does not look kindly on gods meddling in mortal affairs. She may have no choice but to stand by 
and let events unfold. Even with the fate of the world at stake, she had little more to offer me than the means of blowing myself up at a more convenient time. She's done nothing to help us. Mistra wanted the brain obliterated because of this crown. She fears a world in which such power is beyond her control, ready to be claimed by Casas's successor. I thought you were past this kind of temptation. You know exactly where such overreaching leads. Neither of us can know what truly may be if we don't at least try. Potential is nothing in itself. Just a fleeting dream unless we drag it into the waking world. Please, at least think on it. Powerful as he was, Carthus lacks some advantages I can lay claim to. I know Mistra intimately. And I carry a fragment of the weave itself within my body. Cast has achieved many things. Hmm. He never managed that. Long road lies ahead before the crown comes into our possession. All I ask for now is that you do not dismiss this possibility out of hand. Please, at least think on it. I'm urging you to drop this. This crown cannot be reforged. I see. I suppose I am asking you to take a leap of faith. Even the most loyal of companions might struggle to land gracefully. It's been so long feeling... inferior. Shut out from my destiny over such a simple act of youthful enthusiasm. Perhaps I got carried away with the thought this crown could give me back what Mistra took. Cure me. Even. Don't give up yet. There will be an answer. It just isn't the crown. Very well, then. I will try my utmost to share in your optimism. Nothing wrong with a little hope, after all. Mm. Thank you for letting me read this. At least we can face our enemy armed with the knowledge of its true nature and of the stakes, should we fail to defeat it. I expected Night Song to be overjoyed after killing her fair-haired fool. Instead, she just seemed tired. Or do you feel the same way when you kill Casador? <laughs> Hardly. It's going to be the greatest moment of my life. The blood, the screaming. <sighs> just thinking about it makes me smile. Okay, the book. The book. Careful, I uh, the, book, the book, the book, the book. The book radiates power, but the words you read in the codex echo in your mind, guiding your eyes safely across the page. The once indecipherable glyphs now feel dangerously familiar. Promising unholy power to those who can take it. Read on and rest the book's power from it. You. I give both no. As you pass the strange glyphs, you can feel the book resisting. Ghostly voices whisper at you from the dark probing and fighting your mind but your will is iron and you brush past these shades of the past devouring every secret the book has to offer you see now life and death are malleable as clay to be bent and reshaped by your will by your power but as you close the book a nagging doubt whispers in your mind what consequences will there be for calling the dead from their rest? Hmm. 
sounds macabre. Train six ghouls to fight alongside. Ooh. Okay, but that's it. We're done with the book. Thank you very much. Stay alive and see you soon. Bye.